All right, this is semen retention day 219. You have a choice. It's weird because, um, you know what? I'm going to label this something else. It's kind of clickbaity, but, uh, I'm going to label it, uh, you can get any woman you want. So, well, I'm going to talk about kind of a lot of things. All right, first thing, you can get any woman you want. All right, so this is my theory. Um, the queen can never beat the king. So, my theory is if you lock up the most beautiful, attractive woman in a room with the ugliest, unattractive man for, I don't know how long, let's say three weeks. And then you give them like food or whatever. I don't know, food just appears or whatever. They're going to have a kid. Like, that's like my theory because king always beats queen queen can never beat the king i think it's like a law of the universe i mean queen can get another king to beat the king but her herself cannot and um like she will never be like, strong enough to beat the king, I think. That's why, you know, if they were to be in a room together, like, eventually, you know, his brain would outsmart, like, her brain, and, uh, you know, they'd have, like, a kid or whatever. Okay, so that's my first theory. So, you have hope out there. You have hope um it's probably not easy or whatever but just knowing this should take your game up a couple steps the other thing is what i was gonna do this video originally about choice you have a choice like of course you know it varies on how much will you have in your life like but you do have it, and the older I get, the easier it is to, you know, enforce my will. You know, if I want to do something, like, it's easier for me to do. If I want to feel a certain way, it's easier for me to feel a certain way. Like, somebody could, like, make me mad or whatever, and I could just be like, no, I don't want to be mad. And I can just switch the state of being... And, you know, be in, like, a happy place. Whereas in... When I was younger, it was kind of impossible to do. But it was possible. I just didn't know or didn't have strength to do it. The other thing is... You're probably the only one in your world or whatever. I mean, can somebody kill you from outside your world? Yes. Like, a stranger or somebody that hates you could kill you. But... It's like your world, you know, your, you know, nobody can defeat you in your world because it's your world. So don't care like about other people. It's like your world. You do whatever you want as long as you're not hurting like anybody or letting others hurt you. You know, I think you can pretty much control your world and defeat anybody. You can defeat anybody. Because it's your world. And nobody can win in your world. Alright. I don't know if I explained that good. But. Um. And then. What else do I have to talk about? And then I guess I'll do like a little run through of how I'm doing. Um. Well. I've had like urges. No urges. Super urges. Loneliness, uh, I watched porn one time the whole 219 days, 
one time. I felt like I had a good reason. It was like a death or life situation. I'm not going to go into it. Um, how to do it. Uh, but I didn't touch myself. I didn't relapse or nothing like that. And I don't have like cravings like before, maybe like years ago, like once I saw porn, like I had to like touch myself and then the next day I would have to do the same thing. I don't, it's nothing like that. Like I watch porn, whatever. It's just like watching TV. I mean, I get addicted to TV or whatever probably more than porn because I saw it and I have no temptations to watch it I do watch a little bit of women on like social media or whatever like YouTube like I'll search up you know attractive chicks or whatever that I I can't stop that but porn like I'm it's not really my thing anymore um and then 219 days uh i mean time uh oh the light came on time goes by fast but then it goes slow too but time you know does pass uh, not too long ago i was probably in my third month in i'm closer to like my seventh month and uh well my goal is like five years and um yeah it looks like a long way but i'm i'm like strong you know i've been through like strong urges and i feel like i'm strong enough to to go a year and maybe longer hopefully i could get that five years so i could tell you guys like what it's like or whatever and what I noticed about it, like, I'm not really, like, gonna say any benefits or whatever, talk about any benefits right now, because I'm doing this for, like, discipline, I'm doing this for myself, I'm doing this to not feel shame, I'm doing this because, you know, I, it makes me feel stronger about my actions, and then... I'm not, you know, reliant on porn or, you know, feeling like pleasure or whatever. And it's more about that for me. And the benefits, well, you know, like strength, you know, a little bit more courage. You know, I go around friends and family and, you know, I don't feel like ashamed around them. Like, I feel like a saint almost. And, um... Well, that's pretty much it. I think. Thanks for watching. Just I had to do like a quick little update. Just to you know. Just to do it. Thank you.